What's up, everyone? Hope you're having a wonderful weekend so far. Terra Classic is changing course. Now, this is pretty big in the grand scheme of things because we know that <clears throat> that Terra Classic has been performing pretty erratically lately, right? The price has been going down for quite some time, and it's all been ever since, you know, it had this huge run-up. They implemented the 1.2% burn. We saw a volume drop, and we've kind of just had this, this snowball effect, right? The price is just continued to go down and it's been partially uh, tied in with the market performance and everything like that. So now Terra Classic is starting to change course. If we actually take a look at the one month chart here, we can see ever since basically the 21st, it is starting to ascend, right? We are starting to see some sort of positive price performance, especially in a time where it hasn't been that great for Terra Classic. Now, this could be for one of, you know, several different reasons. We obviously know that, you know, we got a positive GDP quarter three report, which, you know, has has put some positivity into the market, right? We also are starting to have some, some pumps as shorts get liquidated. We had the Elon Musk acquisition of Twitter, which has helped obviously increase some of the meme coins, like your Dogecoin, your Shiba Inu. So the market's getting drug up a little bit like that. Or it could just be because there's tons of new proposals coming in for the Terra Classic community. We know that the 1.2% burn tax got changed. It's now a 0.2% tax, and that's been working pretty well so far. Okay, it's it's helped increase volume to some extent. You know, we can see just over the last week that there has been actually an increase in volume. Now, <clears throat> what also may be happening too is there's been proposals of of big big changes in the ecosystem altogether. There's talk of a decentralized platform which could be the the absolutely perfect burn for Terra Classic. It could burn stuff efficiently. It wouldn't be anything more than what you'd normally pay anyways. And that is a great way to obviously help increase adoption throughout using that with other coins too. Now there's also a proposal that's come out talking about accessing a, a wallet to help pay for developers, right? Because obviously these devs have, haven't been getting much for their work so far. And I think it's fair that these devs obviously get, get paid, especially if they're dedicating all this time and effort into helping, you know, improve Terra Classic as a whole, which they are are doing and they're totally com and completely dedicated to doing so. It sounds like they also want to bring on a couple, couple more, you know, friends, we'll call them friends, right? A couple more friends to help with this as well. So I'd say, you know, things are looking pretty darn good for Terra Classic in the, the near term. Obviously, there's still a lot of things that are weighing on the market right now. We know just around the corner here, we have the FOMC meeting. That's only a couple days away. We know that you know we're going to have the CPI report. We got the jobs report, all these sorts of things happening in November. November is going to actually be a very big catalyst for not just Terra Classic, but the entire crypto market. So it's definitely something to watch moving forward. But at least as of right now, they are changing course. They are moving to the upside, which is good to see. Now, obviously, this is never financial advice. I don't know what's going to happen. I'm not a, a genie or anything like that. I don't have a crystal ball. Can't see the future. Crypto obviously moves fast, and sometimes it moves a little faster than what we think. But that's just you know my opinion based on the things that I'm seeing. A lot of positivity happening in the space for Terra Classic. As always, I appreciate you guys stopping in, checking out the video. If you haven't already, do show your support for the channel. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that little bell. Stay updated anytime there's new content live here on the channel. And I make new content every single day. The channel's been growing like crazy. I appreciate all the support you guys have been giving me. And I'm looking forward to seeing how big we can get this thing to grow. So as always, have a wonderful day. And I really hope to catch you in the next one. Take care, guys.